Not again! Right. Well, at least you're back to having only two eyeballs. Hey, my name's Anna. Welcome to Hey Cool Productions. Kick your feet up. Let's have some fun and get creative and starbound. Okay, so I was gonna take a quick uh, peek around, see if anything changed at the outpost. I don't think it did. I think the update that um, Unstable received, I think a day ago or so. No, two days ago, I think. When did I record the last episode? I don't know. But there was an update like an hour after I recorded the last episode of Starbound, and I just wanted to take a peek, see what there was. It looks like it had been a rather minor update. Uh, pretty much the only thing I've noticed that's different, other than Rai, is that when I teleport... There's no sound! Alright, so what I'm gonna do... And I'm going to experiment with something. But I actually am not going to be able to do that with this character. At least I don't want to do it with Pumpernickel. So give me a moment. I'll be right back. Okay. So that was weird. My, my run got... What on earth is that? Oh my gosh, it's adorable. Oh, so our ship has a crystal. Anyway... Um, my thinking is I will take the time to get this character up to where she needs to be to get to planets where it's really easy to just mass build stuff, you know, those empty worlds. Um, and I will use her, Sourdough, as I have named her, I will use her to do speed build challenges because I think it'd be really fun um, and a way to, like play together if you guys bleh, if you guys suggest cool stuff down in the comment section for me to try to build and I will do my best to meet the challenge now the catch is I will have the admin cheat mode turned on that way I'm not limited by my materials um, I would have made the last house bigger in the last speed build for example if I had used cheats and I just don't want to risk messing up Pumpernickel's stuff since I've been using him to get through the content very vanilla-like. So, Sourdough, she'll be the one. Master Crafts Woman, Cobblestone, 50. Crap. What? The perfectly generic items can actually make perfectly generic armor and this stuff is kind of awesome I look freaking ridiculous but um yeah okay well I'm off <laughs> I'm off to go uh, I'm taking that part off at least actually I don't mind this part it's just I, I don't like the headset for that the oh teleporter duh oh old habits die hard anyway i'm off to go catch a bug because i can't seem to figure out how to spawn one okay i have no idea how much footage i've actually recorded because i've been starting and stopping the recording this whole time but i finally can leave the solar system i started in um that said i still gotta get like all the suits and whatnot but you know, let's just find like a desert, a big desert planet of some sort, and um, or a big lush planet probably be fine. And I'll just uh, do a little building. Okay, you know what? Tiny desert planet. A tiny desert planet. I can settle for that. Also, the perfectly generic, um, excuse me, the perfect armor is seriously awesomely OP. Which for cheating my way through for the sake of speed building, I'm totally cool. With that. What? Whoa. Look at the damage on these things. You're one handed? You're both one handed. Well, then, why am I running around with those wimpy daggers when I could have these puppies? <laughs> what should I build? Oh, another thing to note. I think I still have it on me. Yeah. Um. You get the teleporter, your first teleporter core, if you start the game fresh, you get it from fixing the satellite on the outpost. Hello, monster. Are you friendly? Nope. 
That's okay. One hit KO. Oh yo yo. So what shall I build? That's gonna be the question. Let's chop down a cactus. What to build? What to build? I need inspiration. I don't know what to do. There you go. It's a masterpiece. It's a rainbow dome. I've I've been playing for quite a while, so just trying to get to the point where I could fly out of the starting universe. So I kind of lost track of what I planned on building in the first place. Um I've got an idea. Hang on. And it, it's gonna be a lot better of an idea than that. So hold tight to your britches! Give your granny a smooch! Or your grandpa, or your favorite uncle. He's not the creepy one, don't... Don't, don't smooch him. Um... Oh my gosh, that thing is cute! You're adorable! But like I said, hold on to your bun buns! We are building something cool! Well, I'm building, you, you just... You sit back, relax... And think of something to suggest in the comments section that I should try building. That way, it really is kind of like we're actually playing together. I mean, it is a let's play after all. I made something cool. Um, I can't really show it in one shot, though. Oops, just don't me as I punch my microphone stand. Um, that's not what I want. Oops, I didn't mean to kill the cool thing. Oh, zoom level. Let's just accept. Wow, this is really zoomed out. So, okay. There it is. 
Well, there's the... What was the... No. I can hide the UI, can't I? F1 is supposed to hide the UI, but it's... Not. Yeah, anyway. So, I made a sword. It's sort of stuck in the ground. So, I mean, there's nothing super crazy to talk about. It's got stone bed and all that good stuff. I used to flush blocks as like a gem. Um, so yeah. The sword just ever so barely stuck into the ground. But it looks really cool. I'm actually kind of proud of this house, I won't lie. Um, Cause I was pretty proud of the robot too. But anyway, uh, building with cheat mode is significantly easier. So, do it. Leave suggestions down in the comment section below and I'll pick them. Pick one or two um, and go from there. As long as it is nothing inappropriate, there's a good chance I'll give it a shot. So, let's try to maybe make this a thing. I don't know for how long I'll do it, but I think it'd be fun. So anyway, that's gonna do for this episode. I hope you have an excellent day. Give yourself a hug for being awesome. And I hope to see you and all y'all in another video. And until then, later. Here at Hickville Productions, we appreciate and encourage creativity, ingenuity, and large mechanical war uniforms. Allow me to show you some kindness and lightness and use my manners right before my life ends. That way, oh! Son of a fox! That way when Foxy eats my face off, at least I'll die with a smile.